I'm Robert Ramsey and this is Combrethment. Uh, we farm about 700 hectares of combinable crops here uh, with potatoes in the rotation that are let out to neighbouring farmers. So I've been doing precision farming and yield mapping for about 15 years now, a bit more. And the first thing I really started to notice was the effect of compaction on my soils. And in particular, the way I was driving on those soils and creating that compaction. So we started introducing methods of trying to reduce that compaction in terms of how we worked. As I carried on looking at this, I got more interested in being radical about that. So the idea of controlled traffic farming, of having as little traffic on your land as possible, uh, really appealed to me because I was seeing in yield maps low yields where there had been too much trafficking. The basic idea behind the controlled traffic farming is to have maybe 80% of the land completely untouched by tractor tyres. I'd already been using GPS um, RTK steering to ensure my efficiency on, in, in terms of actually producing 24 meter tram lines etc. So I had that infrastructure in place and to get the most out of control traffic farming you want to have wider machinery and possibly less long. So I didn't have to increase the horsepower of my tractors but I had to change the width of my machinery. So we moved to a six meter drill and a six meter cultivator. But we were also already on a perfectly uh, adapted roller system and it was already on the six meters so I run two different systems uh, a harvesting system and and, a, and then a completely separate um, cultivating system the harvesting system I specifically then correct any compaction that I've caused with the harvesting system we started measuring some of the key components of what we changed and Obviously, part of it was to look after our soil better, and I didn't really measure it in terms of the number of worms I'd got and, and potential yield increases and things, uh, because they changed so dramatically from year to year, and it was changing one. But what I could measure was the amount of fuel I burnt and the amount of time it took to establish a crop. And I saw a 40% reduction in both of those figures. The byproduct of the control traffic farming has been a min-till system that really looks after the soil. And so what I've seen is that when it rains, the water percolates through my ground nice and quickly and doesn't pond. This helps the bottom line, but also I can see that I'm treating my soil better. And by treating my soil better, I'm seeing all kinds of benefits in terms of biodiversity on the ground. I'm very happy about that. I know that my carbon footprint is better. I know that my fuel use is better. I know that everything is more efficient as long as I stick to that discipline, but it's certainly given me a much better environmental profile.